Hey everyone, today is November 27th, and we're gonna go down to Fremont to celebrate my homie's birthday. Thanks, man. You're not stealing my water. That's fair. I just paid for everything. That's true. And this guy's talking about water. <laughs> Code. Yeah, that's true. Yo, Henry, drinking already? That was kind of early in the day, huh? <laughs> it's tea, yo. Oh, yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> Look at that. I got the Coco Bee 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 Bop. Mine's Beep and Bop Stone Pot with shrimp. Oh, and then look at look at Birthday Boy. He gets like the best thing on the menu. It's the house special. How special? Has a little bit of everything. What did you get, Leslie? Uh, yours, but with chicken. Oh, with chicken? Oh, okay, cool, 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 cool. Send me up the chocolate and then. Well, I just called Henry special, but I got two eggs, so I'm like, extra, extra special. Stop it. Get some help. What did you get, Savannah? The daily special, too. Oh, daily special? Yeah. Pretty yummy. Right? It's a shrimp. Oh, that hits. Wait, this one is actually really good. What the heck? Yeah, it's not bad. First time. Yeah, this came with this, this suggestion came from Vinny. So you think it sucks? Have you been here, Henry? No, I haven't. Oh, you're not there? No, I don't want to go This place is good. Wait, this place is actually really worth it. It also comes with like this purple rice. Ooh. <laughs> All right, very colorful. Check, uh, Uniqlo overshirt, Airism tee, Lee jeans, dark navy, Air Max 97, silver bullets. Bong hat, don't even work there. Ice on the wrist. We're going to the Fremont Sunday Market, but they changed the location. So we're going to like the one under the bridge right now. It's under here because they think it was gonna rain today, but it's like, as you see, it's like super sunny today. So I got a succulent from this uh, local shop here. You can find the details here. China? The base tea, the oolong. Oh. oh. So they have a base and some additional flavors that they add to it. So I realized when I was editing, I didn't record that many footage of the actual Sunday market. But I do have some extra footage that I recorded back during summer. Yeah, so as you can see here, this is the same booth I showed before. But they have a bunch more during the summertime. Because, honestly, it's more poppin' during the summertime. 
and here's footage of my friend purchasing his succulent from this booth last time i talked to him he said it's still alive so that's a, that's a plus right <laughs> we don't take care of anything that well <laughs> Uh, there's a bunch of food trucks at the Sunday market as well uh, You can go through and check out what you want. We did grab a couple things to eat while we were there So the first thing we got to eat was this sushi burrito and we also grabbed this Himalayan dumpling Going to be honest it looks colorful, but I did not enjoy it. It doesn't taste like anything Yeah, so we grabbed the pork and chicken uh the glaring problem is like there's just too much spices it overwhelms the wrapping and everything else maybe to me it just doesn't taste like traditional like asian dumpling but to me not a fan the sushi burrito was honestly pretty good it was basically just like a chipotle wrap burrito and how can you go wrong with that the last place we went was this macaroon stall the prices were pretty expensive but the two macaroons that we got for me and my friend, we really enjoyed, so um, I do recommend it. Some of the best macaroons I've had. Dude, I don't drink coffee. Mm -hmm. I, was, I was scanning their menu to see if there's anything new I want to try, but it was like all coffee, you know? Troll moment. You guys want to follow together? How to use the oxygen now? Doing an escape room? This is kind of sketch. Yeah, hold your horses. <laughs> I'm Eric. I am your stage manager. I'm quite the person you'll be interacting with for the escape room. Uh, I'm your stage manager, and I'm here to give you, you know, the lowdown about, you know, our particular things here at the bureau. You've probably heard it before if you've gone to some escape rooms. Our group went to the Lucario escape room. Uh, the rule didn't allow guests to record, so I didn't record. But here's some photos. Uh, we did the vanishing act which was rated hard this is my first escape room and the rest of us were new to escape rooms as well so without spoiling i would say the rooms were interactive most of the puzzles do require a moderate amount of thinking and we didn't receive that many hints from the host which they admitted the first part of the puzzle there were like five big puzzles and we went through that relatively quickly like the host said the second part of the puzzle it was like this big reveal, but it made it much more difficult due to the lighting of the room. It was dark and you couldn't see anything, and there was limited time remaining. Uh, this part had like three big puzzles and the final puzzle to solve the room. We got to the last step of the escape room with like three minutes left. We came up with two options on how to solve the puzzle, and it was like we say it out loud because it's a magician act, or what I said, yo, there's these buttons on the ground let's press them but everyone was like no there's no way that would work but the, all the things we saw beforehand were words and stuff on the ground would form the words but yeah no one listened to me so we lost we just finished the escape room we were on the last puzzle and we ran out of time <laughs> We were we thought we were supposed to say the word out loud, but there was like these buttons on the ground where you were supposed to like press. We listen to Benny. Yeah, I told them to press the button and they were like, no. <laughs> so like the person said we did like 99.9%. .9 Whatever. Now I can pull the we gotta throw in the rope. Okay. Peace out everyone. Good luck guys. Thanks for watching. If you want to watch additional content, you can click on these two videos right here below my face. Peace.